morning, Davis County. I am Miles, and this is Annie, and stay tuned for DCHS News. Today is April the 12th. It's a Tuesday. Today is National Grilled Cheese Sandwich Day. Congratulations to the Navy JROTC Orienteering Team and their performance in the United States National Orienteering Meet held on April 1st through 3rd in Henson, Ohio. The team of Fletcher Borman, Mark Cannon, Jacob Goldman finished 6th overall. Individually, Fletcher Borman finished 15th, Mark Cannon finished 20th, and Jacob Goldman 22nd. TCHS also has three students running in the individual national competition. Logan Sawyer finished first in the 17 to 19 age group boys. Evan Swift finished second in the 14 to 17 group boys. And Abigail Roby finished third in the 14 to 17 group girls. Congratulations. Congratulations to the DCHS archery team as they took second place in the first regional tournament held at Green River, the Green River State Area Park last Saturday. The next regional tournament will be April 23rd at Penny Ryle State Park. Attention Mr. Norris's art students. If you received an invitation to display your, your work at the district-wide Night of Art, please contact Mr. Norris and bring your artwork to him by this Thursday. And Mr. Norris drawing students from last nine weeks, please pick up your projects by this Friday or they will be given or thrown away. The first AP U.S. History Study Session will take place Thursday, April 14th from 3.30 to 4.45 in Mr. Goodridge Room, 217. And AP U.S. Government Sessions will be on Mondays and Thursdays beginning at 3.30 in Ms. Sewell's Room. Attention FCCLA members, FCCLA will have a brief meeting tomorrow until 4. Those interested in becoming regional officers are required to attend. Attention students, want to practice or improve your Spanish speaking skills? Go to Ms. Venegas' room, 200B, on Fridays at 7.50 for the Spanish conversation table. Beginners through advanced, all are welcome. Attention seniors, the date for graduation has been set as Friday, May 27th at 6 p.m. in the Sports Center. Senior graduation materials will be delivered at school tomorrow during lunch and in the lobby. Remember to pick up your items as it is very important to check your products for accuracy. Payment should be in the form of cash money and order and or credit debit cards. No personal checks will be accepted on delivery day. Also, for anyone who has not placed their class ring order, we will be taking additional ring orders today during lunch periods in the lobby. Extra ring design kits are available in the student services. Anyone registered for OCTC course in the fall of 2016 needs to register online before April the 15th. An OCTC representative as well as a KWC rep will be visiting DC Friday, expecting all students to have registered. If you have any questions, check with guidance with Mr. Neil Hayden. To all those who are interested, DC's first aid and CPR training will be in the media center again this Saturday from 8.30 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. Sign up is $5 in guidance. First come, first serve to 16 people. If you want to know more, see Ms. Kimbrell. Hey, prom people! Guest verification and after prom forms, which can be picked up in the front office, are due by April 20th. When picking a dress, remember the strapless dresses are permitted, but they must cover the entire midriff. With that, all dance code guidelines still apply. If the dress is questionable, get administration approval or just don't wear it. Tickets will be sold in the lobby during lunch starting today at $20 per ticket. Here's what's going on today at D.C. The D.C. varsity baseball team is traveling to take on Warren Central at 6 p.m. Freshman baseball is taking on Catholic at 6. Girls and boys tennis will be traveling to take on Muhlenberg County at 4.30. And the D.C. softball team is traveling to take on OHS at 5.30. That's all we have today, D.C. Stay 